It is day seven. That means there has been one full week of December. Are you feeling any more festive than you were at the start? I sort of am, but I haven't, I haven't put my Christmas tree up yet, so I need to do that. Anyway, let's get on with the imminent Christmas advent card in the it is day seven. Uh, yesterday, day six, we did get a uh, fun pack. I think they're called fun packs, right? So it is time for day seven. Now, I'm guessing we're going to get a promo today, but I could be wrong, I guess. Uh, oh, I think. Oh, wait, no, I am wrong. Uh, it is. Oh, it's another fun pack. Okay, cool. It is day seven, right? Yeah. Uh, so, we have another sampling pack, and that is Astral Radiance. Oh, okay. You know what? Uh, I keep calling them sampling packs. Sorry, they are fun packs. Because the fun never ends. Uh, and obviously, if you've played uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus, those are the three starters you can choose from. So, it's, uh, it, it, it's a nice, subtle kind of nod. Um, I know the full packs of Astral Radiance actually has the full evolutions of... These three, and I think the Alga and Palkia's origin forms as well. Right, well, so we've got a little piece of paper that uh, tells you about Astral Radiance and some other things. We went over that yesterday. Uh, so, we get three cards. I am curious to see if you guaranteed a reverse hollow, because yesterday's one did have a reverse hollow, but I don't think you guaranteed, so it's a pretty good pull. Right, so we begin with a Rowlet. Very cute. Rowlet is my favourite. A Lowland Star. Oh, wait a second. We got a Rowlet and an Oshawott. Are we going to end with the um, the Cyndaquil? I wonder. Let's see. It is. Oh no. Okay, it is a reverse though. It is Togetic. Well, that that was a nice uh, a nice kind of thematic thing. We got two of the three starters. Very cute. And Togetic, which is uh, a reverse Hollow. Very nice. Don't think I have. I don't think I have this in reverse Hollow. I don't know. It's been a while since I've looked at my Astral Radiance collection action. That was pretty cool, not gonna lie. Uh, right, I'll move this to the side and we'll get on to the other booster packs. All right, so we are gonna delve into here again and see what I can pull out. Ooh, it is a Yu-Gi-Oh pack again. We are, we are hitting one a day usually, which isn't bad. You know, that, uh, that is the, yeah, okay, so gonna, oh wait, no. Sorry, wrong way. I can never work out the correct way. They always put the uh, the like rare or whatever at the back. So we have redeemable jar. Uh, it's a jar you can take back to the shops to redeem. Next up, we have infernoble knight magus Ma Ma morgus. Okay. Next up, uh, we have a trap card, and it is adamancipator resonance. Cool. Don't know what that does. Next up is Junk Sleep, uh, which it, oh, oh, it's picking up the face there as well. My camera is, which is very good. It shows it's working. Uh, next up is uh, Goki, the Power Lord Ogre. I've heard of Goki. Uh, I want to say that is like, uh, it's either an archetype or it's a well-known card in the anime. Maybe we've got AI's Ritual. Uh, well, there, that is AI's ritual. Artificial intelligence ritual. That looks a bit like a robot version of Doctor Doom from the Marvel comics. We've got Witchel Crafter Patronus. Okay, there's lots of anime girls in a, in, in like a traditional Japanese house, it looked like. Uh, next up, we've got Lantern Shark. I think I have this card. I think maybe this was in the Legendary Duelists uh, thing I mentioned before. Next we have Kujikiri Curse. Uh, there's a lot of Ks there, or well, two Ks in the C. And our rare, ooh, yo, let's go, is Ancient Gear Megaton Golem. Sorry, that was really hard to read. That, that might be the coolest card we've pulled so far, I think. That is... Yet again, it's either like a secret or a super or whatever. Um, I can't remember the correct term for it, but it's when the lettering is hollow and so is the card. That is very cool. I really like that design. That is very nice. Right, well, that was a pretty good start. Uh, let's see if we can end it on something equally as hype. 
let's grab the... Ooh, it's another Yu-Gi-Oh pack. Okay, we're double Yu-Gi-Oh today, lads. Can we beat that golem, the mechanical golem thing? Uh, let's see, so this is going to the back. It is a monster, I think our rare is a monster. So there you go. We have dino sewing. Oh, okay, I, I'm, it looks like someone's putting together a dinosaur, I guess, a dinosaur plush. We have, Sorry, I've got a little bit closer to the screen so I can read it. We have Super Heavy Samurai Soul Claw. A lot of S's there. Very interesting. We pulled another Super Heavy Samurai, I think, in another pack, didn't we? We have Malicivorous Spoon. Malicivorous Spoon, I think is how you pronounce that. We've got Wicked Acolyte uh, Chillum Sabak. Cool. He looks like a strange snake deity. We've got a performer pal, Chain Giraffe. Chain Giraffe. Ch Chain Giraffe. The, ooh, that's hard to say. That is a very cute giraffe. Um, shout out Tim if you're watching. He likes giraffes. Uh, we've got performer pal, Thunder Rhino. He's really cool. I like him. He's got he's got the um, the like Buddhist uh, kind of things around him, isn't he? That's really cool. Next up, we have, ooh, Odai's Persona Dragon. That's cool. That's the first dragon we've pulled. If you're interested in Persona, I do have the Persona 5 Royal Limited version of the Japan Crate from November 2022 video I just put up, so... There's a sneaky plug there. We've got uh, Skull, the Melodious Diva. Uh, we pulled another Melodious Diva, didn't we? Can't remember what her name was, but she was definitely a melodious diva. Hey, we've got a putrid pudding body buddies. Okay, this looks like gig Giga Pudding, if you guys remember the meme from like 2010. Giga Pudding! Or I'm just in just saying random stuff that you guys don't understand. Um, and we have a Dino Mist Terran. Ooh, this one's seen a little bit of play, I think, if you look at that corner there. Uh, these are second-hand cards, obviously. These are donated. That is very cool, actually. That's, um... I've not heard of Dino Mist, but it is a Pendulum card, because you can tell, because there's two different things there, and you've got to... I, I never fully understood how Pendulums worked. But you know what? We have had some pretty good pulls today, and we've also had the little fun pack, which was cool. And that about concludes day seven of the imminent Christmas advent calendar. Thank you guys very much for watching, as always, and I will see you for day eight tomorrow. Until then, goodbye.